SPM interface to the 3M A-Test Auto Reader is the first product born from the collaboration between 3M Healthcare and Microsystems and remains the only product on the market to electronically manage and document all aspects of the biological monitoring process. BI monitoring is not only an essential piece of an overall AMI compliance strategy, but historically has presented sterile processing professionals certain challenges with regards to accurate and complete documentation. The interface between SPM and the 3M Auto Reader represents a significant step forward in automated electronic record keeping and is available exclusively to Microsystems clients. The co-branding of this SPM software product illustrates the depth of this exclusive worldwide sales, marketing, and product development relationship between the two companies. This is the cover of the introductory brochure for the Auto Reader interface. The central capabilities of the interface include discipline management of all aspects of both test and control biological indicators and automated real-time documentation of the entire monitoring process. Additionally, the interface can significantly reduce errors and labor consumption associated with manual record keeping and is an essential ingredient in any strategy to go paperless. Finally, as will be discussed in greater detail, the system provides comprehensive tools for managing all aspects of any recall situation. The process begins by opening the screen for the sterilizer load in which the BI test pack was run. The technician will enter their ID and PIN number for specific accountability and will record the lot number of the test BI. The system will prompt the technician to place the BI in an appropriate and available well in the auto reader. Some auto readers are designed to accommodate different BIs meant to be used for different sterilization processes, such as steam or ETO, or different types of cycles, such as steam blue caps and steam brown caps. If a BI is placed into a well that is not meant for the particular biological, an alert will be given to notify the technician of this error and to guide them to an appropriate and available well. The system will recognize the test BI as being placed into an appropriate well, in this case, Auto Reader 1 Well 7. This ties the result from Well 7 to the test BI run in Steam 4, Load 2, as well as to all of the uniquely identified items in that sterilizer load. When the lot number from the test BI is entered, the system will look to correlate that to a control BI with the same lot number in the same auto reader for that same day. If one is found to correlate, the technician will be prompted to confirm they wish to use the control BI. If one is not found, then the technician will be prompted to run a control BI to correlate with the test BI. The system speaks to the recommended practice for control BI that one is required for each lot number for each auto reader for each day. The system will recognize when a control is needed based on the auto reader in which the test BI was placed. Further, the system will correlate test BI lot number to ensure spore viability and will provide prompts and disciplines based on the recommended practice and instructions for use. Instructions for use for control BIs will be provided with a prompt to place the control into an available well in the same auto reader. If the control is inadvertently placed into the wrong auto reader, it will be detected as such and the technician will be guided through the correction sequence until the situation is resolved. If everything is in order, the system will confirm that the process will be complete pending results. These are the two screens for advising the technician to confirm the outcome of the test BI the auto reader has measured. The first is the negative result asking for the technician to visually confirm the result the auto reader and interface have provided. The second is the positive result where the same confirmation is required and where the recall sequence would then follow. These messages, like all others, are pushed to the workstation connected to the auto reader. These are the two screens for advising the technician to confirm the outcome of the control BI the auto reader has incubated. The first screenshot is an example of a positive control BI result asking for the technician to visually confirm the result the auto reader and interface have provided. 
The second screenshot is an example of a negative control BI result where the same confirmation is required and a supervisor should be consulted to determine next steps. This is an at-a-glance status screen for the AutoReader interface. It shows all the AutoReaders in use, what products they are running, brown cap, blue cap, or green cap BIs, whether they are test or control BIs, the sterilizer and load number information, and the time when the final read will be available for confirmation. The status screen is accessible on all workstations running SPM and is useful not only for the SPD staff, but also for end users anticipating availability and delivery of items needed for cases. In the event of a recall, the system will identify all items processed in the sterilizer in question back to the last known negative BI result. It also provides direction on retrieval and reprocessing while attaching alerts on all items to ensure potentially compromised instrumentation never comes into direct patient contact. In the event one of these items has been used, the system will identify the procedure so that all appropriate notifications can be made and essential actions are taken. While the essential elements of the AutoReader interface focus on management of test and control BIs, the automated electronic documentation capabilities ensure real-time accuracy and compliance, as well as the means for moving to a paperless documentation system. Management of the test and control BI process, automated electronic documentation, real-time availability of results and comprehensive tools for handling all aspects of load recall scenarios, the 3M ATAS monitoring interface is a significant leap forward in compliant practices and documentation.